For seven years, the Church of Christ at Seminole has been rendering enthusiastic worship to God in its current location. We've had wonderful successes in our worship and in our service, but like other congregations, 2010 was a challenging year for us. Our attendance was down, and for the first time in recent memory, we finished the year with a deficit in our contribution. And our bills were up as well. Still, we had some notable successes with the beginning of a new college age class, as well as a young families class. In addition to that, we've incorporated a seniors ministry that includes Palmer Smith as our minister, and we continue to offer divorce care throughout the fall. In addition, we've started a Facebook page, and we urge you to friend us on Facebook. Some of our members continued our annual Turkey Hotline. Through their efforts and members' donations, 60 needy families received Thanksgiving dinners, largely put together by the young ladies you see at work here. Our congregation has a long, proud tradition of mission work in Latin America, especially in Cancun in Mexico and several other congregations in the nearby area, including Playa del Carmen, Kilometer 80, Solferino, and San Juan. Annual trips allow us to stay involved with these mission works. Some of the native congregations in Mexico are very small, but they're doing very powerful work in the Kingdom of God, and we're grateful to have an opportunity to partner with them. In addition, we support a full-time missionary in Nicaragua at the El Almendro Church of Christ in San Marcos. They have a thriving youth group and the congregation continues to grow and develop in depth and strength in service in the Kingdom of God. Our missionary in Nicaragua is continually doing home evangelism, but the entrenched poverty in that country allows us an opportunity to do benevolent work by providing food packets for needy families. In July, a small group from Seminole will conduct an evangelistic campaign with the students of the Bible Institute of Central America. At Seminole, we're confident that God will continue to bless us in 2011.